Now we're doing Roman chairs. Let's see it. How many? 25. Okay. A slight tap of the heels, not toes. Graceful. Graceful. Her hands are behind her on the bench, holding herself secure. Eleven. She's gonna do 25. 12. 13. Good girl. 14. 15. 16. 17. 18. 19. 20. Don't slam them. One. Number two. Slight. Graceful. Three. Four. Good girl. 25. All right. Four sets of 25 equals 100 reps with 30 seconds rest in between sets of 25. Okay, so you can do 25 rest, 30 seconds, 25 rest, 30 seconds, 25 rest, 30 seconds, 25, done. Let's go. Notice how her upper body really isn't moving. Thank you guys. Remember, toes to the ceiling. Now these burn a lot more if you're not moving your upper body. Okay, she's got one more set of 25, and then we hit 100. These ones I'm gonna have her do a little manipulation. I'm gonna have her actually scissor her legs in and out. Okay, she's still gonna touch the ground, tap the ground gracefully, come close to the ground 25 times, the same as before. I really don't know how else to word it, but you basically have to lift your butt up, press it forward so you don't slide on your butt fat or your butt skin, whatever you wanna call it. All of us have done sit-ups. All of us have slid on our butt. Next time you're going to do sit-ups or any sort of leverage movement with your abs, watch yourself. If you're skidding at all on your skin, that is basically a sticking point for your abs and you're avoiding it every single rep you do. So she starts these, you'll watch her lift up her butt, scoot forward and then lean back, basically pulling as far away on her skin as she can. Then she's gonna try to hold that movement and pivot, hinge at her hips. Her legs are braced underneath the bench, allowing her to basically keep her lower body stable. Only thing that moves once again is the upper body. Let's go. Okay, start right here. So lift your butt up, press forward. Now lean back. Slide back that way. Money. Now she can't slide on her butt. Bring one up. Where do you want my arms? Right here. Chin to chest.
before her legs were beyond her feet, okay? They were almost in front of this. Now I've got her sliding back. This creates a different position, it's a different angle, and a different part of the abs. The movement will be exactly the same. She's gonna lift her butt up slightly, slide forward, then push back to the same position she started in before she lifted up and moved slightly forward. Only difference being, she caught the skin of her butt and rolled back this way so she doesn't slide on it. Let's do it. Chin to chest. Now these ones, she's not going to go all the way down. Three. Four. Five. Six. Good girl. Seven. Eight. Nine. Get down in the pain zone. Ten. Come on down. There it is. Eleven. Down to my hand. Twelve. Yes. Do not avoid this pain. Good girl. Fourteen. Now she's 20 minutes into abs. 60. It's natural. It's human nature to avoid the pain. Huh. It's human nature to avoid the pain. Don't do it. Endure it. Enjoy it. Done. Now you find yourself, you want to come within about an inch to two inches of the bench, maybe three or four. You'll find yourself stopping early because it hurts. We're not going through the motion here, folks. We want to build abs. We gotta stress them out. Okay, you can see her leg placement. Now her legs are all the way back here. Her knees started here. Second set was here. Now she's all the way back here. You can tell because her head is hanging off the bench, actually. Go ahead and come on up. Chin to chest for 20. Hey, that's sweat on the bench. Perfect. <laughs> all right. Come on. Four. And if anybody's wondering what top she's wearing, it's Lululemon. drinking their water right after she says it. Uh, how, if you were trying, can you guys drink water right now? Or even talk, discuss, think. If you really, really tried, your brain is mush for about 10, 15 seconds after you're set. Now she's at a 20 second rest. Tell them how you feel. I'm ready for water. 